So the discussion for this particular study leads to four different categories. The categories are software development and design, programming concepts, artistic concepts, and game concepts. So those are the four categories of skills and concepts that students engage in. So let me unpack them. So this is on page 17. When engaging in game design or modification, students will engage in software development and design that is comprised of uh, teamwork, building critiques and reflections on others' works, project scheduling, project management, iterations and refinement, and prototyping. So all those things that can be really helpful for any kind of content area, just not just computer science in general. However, for the computer programming concepts that are learned, they mention that students learn threading and event-based programming, object-oriented programming, component-based development, and software patterns. And then under the artistic concepts, they mention that when engaging in game modding, that students learn lighting effects, architecture design, and character design. And then under the game concepts, they mention that students learn game design, game mechanics, and balancing game aesthetics and game play. So in other words,